uh, Living Life with Purpose. I'm your host, uh, Phil Foster. I want to talk to you today about something that's really uh, important. It's really interesting. It, it may not happen every day in your life. I want you to be open to it and be aware that sometimes God has divine appointments for you. By divine appointment, what I mean by that is that God comes along and steers us, if you will, to a place to meet people or to be engaged in activity that the kingdom of God needs and God desires. For example, in um, Acts chapter 8, I think we see a picture of this. Philip was preaching a great revival. Souls were being saved. Great things were happening. And in the midst of that, God gets a hold of him. He says, I want you to leave all this great stuff. I want you to go out into the desert. And when he gets out into the desert, there's a guy coming along in a chariot. He's an Ethiopian eunuch. And, and Philip notices he's reading a scroll. And he says, what are you reading? He says, I'm reading this. He says, well, do you understand? He says, no. Come to find out it was like Isaiah 53. And Philip runs alongside, gets up in the chariot, begins to explain to him about what Isaiah 53 means and the suffering of the servant, our Savior, Jesus. And, and anyway, the guy comes to faith and knows Christ. And later, Philip's able to baptize him in water. And the reason I, I share this with you is sometimes we're doing things and God has something else for us to do. So we need eyes to see and ears to hear. And just do our very best to be obedient to whatever it is God puts in our heart. Philip was preaching a great revival, but God saw one singletary soul out in the desert that he knew that he could use Philip to reach that guy. So today, tomorrow, the next week, as you're going about your business, just be sensitive to the voice of God in your life and see if maybe God may not have a divine appointment for you somewhere to share the, your faith and the good news of Jesus Christ with someone in the community. Well, I'm going to stop for there today till we get together next time. May God bless you and hey, have a great day.